Hi guys and welcome back to another LucaVision video and today we are going against the grain. It is not a New Music Monday, it's not a Flashback Friday. That is because the national final season is upon us and it's taken over my schedule. So today, looking at that little title down below. Bonjour. Ça va? Hiya, oh yeah, you're right. We are jumping in head first and having a little look at all of the finalists for France's national selection. C'est vous qui décidez. It's you who decides. Now, if you guys have missed it, I have only listened to very, very, very small clips of each finalist. And you can find that video by clicking the link up here. What I wanted to do was I wanted to see which song had the most instant impact. And so far, I can say that my favourite is Tutti and Voila. But guys, you know this, anything can change and the little clips often don't do the songs justice. Therefore, I've taken the time to clear the schedule and have a look at each of these songs individually. Starting with the one that you guys have been suggesting the most, Pony X. Loads of you guys have been saying that it's your favourite and apparently it's the bookie's favourite too. <laughs> And I gotta be honest with you guys, based on the little clip, I can't say I was too impressed. But as aforementioned, listening to the full track can change everything. I'm hoping for a hidden gem among that tiny little clip. And before we get cracking guys, I want to know who is your favourite and who do you think I should be having a little look at next? Leave your comments down below. I cannot wait to see who your favourites are. Anything's got to be better than last year, right? So I am super pumped to have a little look and see why this one is classed as the favourite. You guys know what's coming. Enough chat. Let's react. Judging from the title, this already sounds like a strange track. I'm really intrigued. Let's go. Like the favourite. Let's see if it's your favourite. Funk. From the get-go, it's funk. Did not expect that voice. Angelic. I'm loving his vocal. There's an old school kind of funk vibe and I'm loving it. Now I get what the Pony X is. There's a pony and there's an X. Is that right? Oh, he's got a rasp in his voice. It's so good. That dancing's a no from me. But that drop, really? Okay, now it's good. It's very much BTS. It's giving me BTS vibes mixed with an old school funk feel. Soul in there as well. That's what I'm loving. It's such a mixture of different genres. Lovely progression into the second verse. It's really lifted the song from the first verse. This is a bop. I love all of the builds. I just don't like the drop. I feel like the song is just getting lifted and lifted. That emotion in his voice. I love the vocal effect as well. It's not auto tune, it's just like some sort of distortion. See, this time that drop was so much better. There's just more layers and there's more musicality. Love it. See, and I love this because it's a bop, but there's also a great part in this song, the bridge, where he can show off his vocals. Oh, lovely build. Love it. Mmm. See, this bit, I know it's a novelty bit, but we don't need him to go, on it, on it. And this terrible drop, I don't like this drop. But it's this bit that's great, shot me down with your love. It's so attainable and so catchy. Oh, and that grit in his voice. It's so juxtapositioning, but it works so well. Okay, I need to take it back what I said previously in the clip video. That was brilliant. The clip did not do it justice. That was a bop. It was a tune. It was iconic. There was novelty in there. Perfection. Loved it. So guys, all of my thoughts were pretty much just summed up in that video. There was bits of everything in there and that's what made it so attainable. It kept you guessing, it kept you on your feet. There were a lot of different twists and turns in there. To be honest, I loved the build and I loved the bridge. And the pre-chorus was fantastic. But that drop, ugh. Not a fan of the drop to begin with. Maybe it's gonna grow on me. I know it, I was gonna say maybe it's more of a grower than it is a shower, but that is definitely a shower. It is there, it's in your face. Like, bam, I'm here. But what I love is that it is a banger, but he has put so much emotion and feeling in the vocals. And that rasp in his voice, it really gives it that extra kind of hint of soul. I am loving the elements in the instrumentation. It's so BTS mixed with an old school kind of funk. It really culminates and it is something special. So am I a fan? Yes. Do I think it's going to be my favourite? Uh, possibly not. But guys, that's just what I think. Let me know all of your thoughts and what you think of Pony X. 
Leave it down below in the comments section so I can see why you love this song. But guys, that's everything from me today. If you enjoyed that video, don't you forget to give it a big thumbs up to show me that you are behind Pony X. And if you liked that drop, please give it a thumbs up so I can see who actually does like the drop. Also, don't you forget to hit that subscribe button and that bell notification button. That way you can keep up to date with all of these videos that are coming out. I'm going to be reacting to all of the contestants for France this year. Anyway, that is all from me today. All that's left for me to say is thank you so much for watching. Please stay safe, look after yourselves, Merry Christmas, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, everybody. Goodbye.